So now we're going to assess how to look at vessels um, using color Doppler. And we're going to use two vessels as an example of that. It's going to be the radial artery and the brachial artery, um, just to get a sense of how color Doppler works. So I'm going to use his arm. We're going to use a linear probe because it's a superficial structure, these arteries. So here, the indicator is towards the patient's right. And on the screen, the very top of the screen, that is the radial artery. And what if I compress, you see that the veins compress next to the artery, but the artery is still pulsating there. That's the radial artery there. If you put color flow on the radial artery, okay, you see that you see red flow in the artery during systole. So that's, that means that if you look at the top right of the screen, you see the red means towards the probe, blue means away. It's a concept called the BART concept to help you remember. So blue is away, red is towards. So here my angle, my probe is facing this way. So the, the artery, the flow is going towards the probe here and you can see it's red. But if I change my angles the other way, as it goes this way, now the flow is going away from my probe and now it looks blue. So a lot of people think that color Doppler is either means red means artery, blue means vein. It's actually all it has to do with is flow. Is the velocity of flow going towards the probe? Now it looks red. Or if it's going away from the probe, it looks blue here. And if you're perpendicular, what you notice is that, if I find that, th is there's no, it'll turn black, right? So as you hear more and more perpendicular, you don't really see a red or black. It just looks a red or blue. It looks kind of both red and blue because we're not either towards or away from the flow. We're perpendicular to the flow itself. So another artery that you can look for is a brachial artery. It's the same artery you're looking, at, you're measuring when you're measuring for your blood pressure. So here, in the forearm, is your or antecubital fossa is your brachial artery. And you can see it pulsating there. And once again, you can get color flow on that. And you can see the flow of the vessel. So this one has a higher velocity. You can see that it's more than the radial artery. And once again, blue is towards here. I'm oh, sorry, blue is, uh, red is towards, and blue is away here. So once again, red towards the probe. You can see it's red here. And then now I'm shifting my probe, so now the flow is going away from the probe, and it turns blue. And that is a brachial artery.